What's good, everybody? It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject here, and welcome back to our Vanderbilt Rebuild Dynasty uh, 3 and 1, week 5. This week we have FCS East. Um, you know, we already know how these games are going to go. This one probably won't last long, you know, but you'll be surprised because our defense be on some BS sometimes. And then, you know, we're probably going to make this a doubleheader, you know, and go ahead and play Mizzou the next game right after this one as well. A quick look at the college football landscape right now. Clemson's the number one squad, followed by Oklahoma, Notre Dame, Texas A&M. Bama already lost the game, but they're still in the five slot. Uh, Georgia lost the game as well. Ohio State, Washington, Mississippi State, LSU, Stanford, UCF is in the top 15. Uh, Texas, Michigan, Auburn, Northwestern, surprisingly. Florida, Utah, Ole Miss, Michigan State, Arizona, Iowa, Tennessee, Penn State, and Oregon. Heisman watch list. Texas A&M has two players, Connor Bloomerick and Deshaun Corbin. Followed by Etienne, Travis Etienne out of Clemson, Ian Book from, from Notre Dame, and Kylan Hill out of Mississippi State. Real quick, taking a look at the uh, SEC East standings. We are third in the conference at 1-1 one one, uh, because we lost to the SEC West opponent, Ole Miss. We have Georgia in a couple weeks. <laughs> I don't, you know, maybe we'll beat them. And remember, we have the locked-in rivalry game against uh, Tennessee. So in theory, we can knock off both of these teams. And, uh, you know, if we beat the rest of these teams and be in first place. But, of course, anything can happen in theory when it comes to sports. Taking a look at stats around the NCAA. Neil is sixth in passing yards. Uh, Keyshawn Vaughn is second in rushing. Receiving, Shelton Mosley is seventh. Tackling, we have uh, three of the top five tacklers. Sack leaders were 33rd. Adi Ingbu with three. And then interceptions, Anderson is a uh, 23rd with two. Nothing else less to say, man. One of these uh, teams you schedule at home, you know, to sell some tickets and put a lot of points on the board for the home crowd. Let's make sure we actually get that done. Let's go. We have some visiting prospects here in this game. We're bringing in four-star Justin Dunlap. We need to have two sacks with a linebacker, Randy Clement. We need to have two picks and or four passes swatted away. And then also we got a kicker coming in. We need to make a kick with four you know, within 40 plus yards, within 40 plus yards, 40 yards or more. All right, guys. So here we are starting off on defense, seeing if uh, our defense can keep that momentum that they have from the UMass game and keep it here. And okay. That's probably one of the shortest runs we've given up to start off a game this season. Get there, knock it loose. What the hell? Oh, I hit start by mistake. So Tim Peterson's one for one FCS East is quarterback. Completes his first pass of the day. Ah, oh, I clicked off by mistake. Can't make the tackle. And, okay, we don't get called for the face mask there. Yes, we do. FCS East is mounting the drive against his dog. Here we go. So, play action. Ah, oh, can't undercut it with, 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 uh, with Anderson. Doesn't quite have the jumping ability. We have to start off the game the same way every single week. Before, you know, we get into our bag a little bit. We got to give up a bunch of yards. We got to give up points or else it doesn't count, right? All right, this time we're in the backfield. Dimitri Moore getting his first tackle of the game. Here we go, second and goal. Oh, let me get back on sides. I almost made a mistake there. Oh, he hits the, the guy out of the backfield. And he, wow, baptizes the DB Cameron Watkins there to get into the end zone. Four for four, 56 yards and a touchdown pass for these dudes. Our team is hot trash, yo. <laughs> Our defense is garbage, bro. Like, it's not, it's not even funny, man. Got some blocks here on the kick return. Oh, back juke from Boulder. Stay up. Ah. With Keyshawn Vaughn second in rushing this season, we are going to try to force feed him to get another 200-yard game. This is the perfect team to do it against. Good blocking up front. It's just, you know, when you're just not that fast, any team can catch. All right, second and nine here. Get on oh, my here. goodness. Really, though? Oh, wow. We're going to mess around and lose this game, bro. We are going to mess around and lose this game. I can see it now. It's going to be funny. It's definitely going to be funny. Look at this. Super free. Come back to the ball. Nope. There we go. Let's go. Hold on to the goddamn ball. I believe they're going to run it because we suck at stopping it. They do run it. We were run, commit, middle, and still. A gaping hole for Holmes to run through. All right, first and 10 here for FCS East. And they kill us with the with the run with the uh, not the the wide receiver screen. 
Nope. Give me that. Anderson, you got to catch it, baby. You got to catch it. They go with the screen. Come on, Anderson, make the tackle. There we go. I don't care about the pick. Just make the play. One of the most stressful things about these teams, they run literally everything in playbooks, so you never really know what they're going to do. Give me that. There we go, Pert. Thank you. Jeez, oh, man. The offense won't score. You get the job done for them. Ah, you're getting hawked down. Down inside the 10, possibly at the 5. Much, much needed turnover. Oh, they actually made a block. Wow. Shout out to our left our left tackle. All right. So we scored, but we missed our extra point. Trying to make a play. Trying to get pressure on the quarterback. All that. Let's go. Man in motion. Oh, I missed that tackle. I straight up missed that tackle. Wow. All right. Third and 10 here. Here comes Stupid. the screen. And more misses. The damn pick. Here we are. Down four. To the F FCS East, uh, whatever they, they are, the Wolfpack or something like that. Bowler, great return. Get off me. Let's go, man. We need something to, to jumpstart the deep. I mean, the offense. All right, second and second and six here, man. They're jamming on the outside. Oh my! <laughs> We're 0 for two on third downs here today. Are you surprised? I'm not. Please make the throw, Neil. Shelton Mosley holds on to it. Oh, my goodness. We needed that. Look at this, dog. Nobody's getting open. No time to throw to God. All right. Third and 10 here. Over his Stupid. head. Pinkney, nope. We're heading into the locker room down four to this squad. We get the ball in the second, start of the second half, but it doesn't look good, bro. We cannot score. Surprising defensive struggle here. First and 10. Once again, bars. All right. Make two people missed. There we go. Make that block. Okay, Neil. Way to make up for all the BS you've been doing. Look how big of a dude Neil is compared to those DBs. So 46 yard pick up there for Raleigh Neil. He's got a lot more. He needs to do make up a lot more where that came from. Alright, boys, we're in the red zone. Looking to come away here with some points. Vaughn breaking a tackle. Let's go. That's a decent run. Alright, second and three here. Another read option. Raleigh Neil truck his little ass. First and goal. We better come away here with points. I mean, a touchdown, not just points. A damn touchdown. Tossed the other way. Vaughn's in untouched. Thank you. They don't want to see you do better than them. They don't want you to have a bigger pull than Kanye. Make a miss. There we go. Neil with his second big run of the day. All right, first and 10. The read option seems to be the moneymaker out here today. Nope. You know, oh, nope. check Neil out. Oh, breaking two tackles. Second and three. Riley Neal gets to keep it again. Blocks me and him on the outside. Nope. Ooh. Oh, stay up. Ah, get in the end zone, big man. All right, guys. We are less than a yard away from extending our lead here to seven points, possibly eight if we make the extra point. And Vaughn beast mode's his way into the end zone. Finally, we got stuff going. It's a shame how our dudes are getting beasted up there, yo. A damn shame. I'm going to keep throwing it. They're going to learn. That way we can chew them up and film. Finally, we hit Shelton Mosley off the line this time, and we'll score, man. Jeez, oh. All right, go first and 10, under five minutes officially. Really, nigga? Oh, my God, dog. Really? So with that false start, they shot themselves in the foot. They have to go for it here now on fourth down. Should be an easy stop, but you know how we've been getting giving it up all day. Get over here! And we get the sack. Does he break the record right there? Nope, that was somebody different. We are three for seven in the red zone today. God awful, bro. Horrible, my dude. Nope. A lot of running nope. room there, but oh wow, way to break up out of that, man. And that's the game, dog. All right, boys, that's going to do it. The clock hits triple zeros. We get a win here at home. Uh, Keyshawn Vaughn, the player of the game, 93 yards, three touchdowns. Uh, you know, we ended up getting the pick when I super sim the rest of the game there. But, you know, other than that, Peterson killed us, you know, despite the two picks. And he almost got a big time upset. We had one pick as well with Pert, but we're going to take a look at the uh, final stats. First, looking at the scoring summary, it was a struggle. We got shut out in the second quarter. We shut them out in the third, but we put up 21 in the third. And that's what ultimately saved us. 
saved us here today. Riley Neal, horrible, seven for 20, one touchdown, two picks, sacked five times on the ground. He went 16 for 120 in a touchdown though. Neal was 15 for 93 and three touchdowns. In the air, Shelton Mosley, of course, making the most of his catches, three for 84 in a touchdown. He's showing two for 30. Lemscomb only had one catch today, one for seven. Defensively, Coppett led us in tackles with nine all solo. Dimitri Moore had eight all solo. Adebengu had seven all solo. Both of them had two plus tackles for loss. Adebengu had three sacks along with Zen Turner. Haney, Coppett, and Moore had a sack as well. We caught two picks, one to Pert, which you guys saw, and then Dimitri Moore caught one in the Super Sim. And, you know, wasn't the prettiest, but, you know, you don't have to, your wins don't have to be pretty. You just got to get it done, man. So, all right, guys. So, moving it to next week for the next game against Missouri, we finally get our first commit. It is the 75 overall kicker, Marshall Dixon. Welcome to the squad. All right, guys. Here we are back at home against Missouri. This uh, <clears throat> schedule has really been on our side, giving us all these home games. So, let's just come out here and take care of business. See, Riley Neal struggled last at last game in this episode, so hopefully he can turn that around. <clears throat> so first and 10 here early. We need to play for the run. We know everybody knows we struggle stopping the run. Nope. Kelly Bryant keeps it, but he breaks the tackle. First nope. play, and he breaks another, and he is off to the races. We only have a couple more people who can catch him. He finally runs into a blocker of his, and once again, we give up a 50-yard-plus run to start the game. So Kelly Bryant's 0 for 2 here to start off uh, their drive. Definitely works out in our favor. He can't complete a pass right now. Little audible. Oh, they go to screen. Get there more. You get baptized, but we bring them down as a squad, and we're going to hold them to three. That's huge after we gave up that 50-yard run. All right, third and three. Let's get it. Oh, he's wide open. Horrible, horrible, horrible. First and ten now. Copy. Oh, make the tackle. Oh, wow. What a big whiff. Second and five right here. Make the throw. Wow, that wasn't to Lipscomb, but I'll take it. It worked out in our favor. Wow. All right, we go second and eight. A lot of people in the box. Going to bring Bowler over the middle here. Oh, my God. He's wide open. You got to make the throw. You got to make that throw. So here we are settling for three. His second time missing Shelton Mosley wide open for six. The kick is up. It is good, and we are on the board. Third and five, 50% on third down conversions today. Wow, he made a pass. That was a tough. I, he made a precision pass where I predict use precision accuracy. We're 50% here in the red zone. We have a turnover here. I believe it was a turnover, but first and 10 nonetheless. Good read, good blocking. Come on, Keyshawn. Woo, they hitting, hitting. Second and inches. Big boys up front, we need you. Neil turns around, hands it off to Vaughn. He's trying to fight his way in the end zone, and he gets himself a tough touchdown. All right, first and 10, tie ball game, brand new. 0-0. Zero, zero. Everybody keeps it. Ooh, hurt lightning him up. All right, here we go. Third and seven, baby. Oh, beautifully ran route. Good throw. Let's force a turnover here, fellas. He's taking off. Stupid. Get there, Anderson. Wow. He just mushed my linebacker like it was nothing. Kelly Bryant, a.k.a. James Franco. Yeah, it's definitely a run. Oh, it was Derek Coppin. I just, it was just too much momentum. I couldn't, they wouldn't let me set my feet. Come on, Neil, do it. Do it with your legs, baby. Let's you go. Hold on to the rock. Of course he fumbles. Of course. Of course. Wow, how's he wide open? We're in man coverage, bro. Get there, fellas. Make a tackle. Nobody's going to come up. Come on, yo. Y'all weak. Oh. Better come back and get it. Lips come. Let's go. All right, fellas, so here we are going into the locker room. Only down 11, you know. Uh, our defense has to play better, but they're playing decent. Our offense has to be better. Riley has to make some of these throws. All right, fellas, get us the ball back, man. Who's going to be that person to make the, to create a turnover against Kelly Bryant? Oh, he ran it right up the middle. Nobody's there. Uh, Missouri's in their bag right now. Kelly Bryant, you know, started off a little, a little shaky. 
But he's where he needs to be now. He's wide open. Nobody's there. We're in man coverage. Don't know how that's. A turnover needs to be created. Just a run. Come on, more. Get off that block, man. Jeez. Third and nine. Let's go, boys. Holding them to three will be huge here. Make a play. Woo. Let's go, man. Let's go, Dante. So we're just down two scores here. That's huge, man, because we could have been down three had we gave up six. Come on, bowler. All right, boys, here we go. First and ten, man. One safety high. Trying to catch him napping. Can you make a throw, Riley? He's open. Finally, he connects with Shelton Mosley on the play action. He's off to the races. Ten, five, and we tripped up. I should have jumped. Ah! But nonetheless, we're in prime position to punch it in. Time for the big boys up front to earn those scallies. Bapst. Gonna hand it off to you, big man. Get in there, baby. Let's go. Baps is a lineman, too. We because I forgot we don't have a fullback on the squad. All right, boys. Here we go. Down seven. Need to get a stop here. We need to rock back. He's wide open. Make a tackle. All right, we forced him out. We gotta try to get the rock from him, man. That's what I want to try to do. Wide open. Getting eight, getting eight up out here. We gotta get pressure on the quarterback, yo. It's just, it just has to happen. We don't ever get pressure on them. Man in motion. So option. We hit Kelly Bryant. Okay, let's go. We finally get a stop, man. This is our opportunity to knot it back up here. I don't think a game has been tied since 0-0. Get out there, 69. Make that block. Yes, sir. You made two. I love it. Let's go, Vaughn. All right, we go. This corner, he's good, but, he, but he's eager to make a play. He has a step. Get it out there. Let's go, Mosley. Oh, my goodness. You got to hold on to that, big dog. Yo, shout out to their corner. Proving why he's an impact player, man. Because that was huge, bro. That was that was huge right there. That was a huge stop, man. Because that was six. All right, here we go. Third and four. He's open. Make the throw. Come on, Pinkney. Let's get it. Second and goal. Looking to punch it in. Tough throw. What a dot, Riley. Let's get it, man. All right, guys. Let's get it, man. Adi Yangbu's going to be on uh, on spy duty. Oh, I left him. I should have kept following him. And they scored just like that. I wasn't going to be able to keep up with him anyway. So we find ourselves in yet another shootout. We've been in quite a few of these this year because we can score. Excuse me, but we can't really stop anybody. So that's our downfall right now. Oh, get rid of it. Ugh. Riley has some confidence out here today. He's got an open receiver. Kalaja Lipscomb. Wheels, baby. Burn him. Let's go. Let's get it. And we quickly answer back ourselves. Bang. Oh, and Neil breaks his own record here with that throw. <laughs> Let's go, man. All right, fellas. With that play, that's going to take us into the fourth. Tie ball game here. 34 all. You know, we just got to find out which team wants it more. Third and eight right here, baby. Keep them out of field goal range, too. Are they going with the uh, with the four verts? The cutback is coming. Nope. Oh, he dropped it. That's big, baby. Let's go, man. Woo. So they're going for yet another long field goal here. Their kicker's already missed one here today. He's two for three. His longest one is 40. This is well past 40. That thing is up, and it is wide right. Let's go. Second wide right kick from this kicker here. You know, from a distance greater than like 45. Yet they still keep going for it. Little screenplay here. Bowler has some blocks. There we go. Oh, the back joke. Oh, that was almost nasty. Chains moving, clock moving. Exactly what we want. Easy read. Keyshawn Vaughn has some room. He breaks a tackle and he's inside the tent. Find a way to get it in. See, pink me. That's good. It. Let's get a broke a tackle, man. That's what my boy does, dog. 40 points, an extra point away from going up seven. One more stop from the defense will be huge right here, man. I'm going to go to man here, watching out for the for the screens. Pick a play. Oh, you knocked it loose. That's making a play. Let's get it. Is that Cam? He's taking off. Come on, cop it. Mm, all right, you slowed him down for everybody else. Kelly Bryant had 98. Rushing yards at one point. He now has 90 because we've hit him for losses, you know, a few times here. 
goes to the flats. Make the tackle more. Okay, let's go. Woo! All right, now we can start working on this clock. 4.30 left in this game. You already know we're about to rely on Vaughn. Oh, man. Coach brought us out here in goal line. <laughs> no secrets to what we're doing in goal line. Oh, wow. Way to, way to fight and get those two yards. They're super-duper uh, aggressive there, and it works to our favor. Five-yard pickup. This is Neil's best game. Even besides the eight-touchdown game, I fight this is his best game by far. Third and three. He has a step. Come on, Kalaja. Keep having a big game you're having. Let's go. He breaks the tackle, but they finally bring him down at the five. 51-yard pickup. Woo, baby. Let's get it, man. Second to goal. Missouri used their first time out. 216 left here in the game. Everything's on conservative here. And Vaughn is met at the goal line. All right. Tried to truck my way into the end zone. Come on, Keyshawn. Get in there untouched, baby. And that's going to be the ball game. All right, guys. That's going to do it. The clock hits triple zeros. And we get a big, big win here at home. Our fifth consecutive. Uh, Riley Neal plays a huge game out here, man. A huge, huge game. His best game of the season. 14-point comeback victory. 416 yards, three touchdowns, 47 yards on the ground. Doesn't get any better than that. Looking at the scoring summary, we got shut out in the first. You know, lost by one in the, in the second, one by 11 in the third. Then we won by 14 in the fourth and shut them out. You know, we were down 14. We ended up winning by 14. The defense really steps up when we need them to so far this year. Player stats, Riley Neal with his best game of the season, 21 for 33, 416, three touchdowns, 63 completion percentage, 20 yards a, a, a completion. Sacked twice, but his longest pass of the day was 85. Uh, Keyshawn Vaughn still doing what he does, 25 for 122 with two touchdowns. Uh, 12 for 47 but for Riley and one for one with a touchdown for Braden uh, Bapst. Receiving-wise, Kalaja Lipscomb, tremendous game. 7 for 184 and a touchdown, 26 yards a catch. Bowler, 5 for 63. Shelton Mosey, 6 for 104. For him to not get as many catches, he makes the most, you know, when he racks them up. Pinckney with a touchdown, 3 for 41. And Marco with his one catch, making it count with a touchdown. Vaughn had two catches out of the backfield as well. Defensively, Brendan Harris and uh, Dimitri Moore led us in tackles with six all solo. Five tackles for Watkins and Coppett. A uh, bunch of tackles for loss. We only had one sack here today by Adebengu. You know, he's been doing his thing all year. And then we caught the one pick by Allen George. And we got up out of here. And, you know, we only have one loss in the SEC still. And it's not even on our side. So, like I said, if we could beat Tennessee and Georgia, we'll be in the money. But hopefully you guys enjoyed this one, man. If you did, stomp and smash that like button. Hit me up in the comment section below. Subscribe if you're new for more of this. It's your boy Uncle Sam's Reject, RKGames.com. I'm out of here. Peace.